Michael Cameron here, and um, I have a very interesting uh, video to show today. A couple of months ago, um, this company called Stability AI released their Stable Diffusion uh, AI model that could generate pretty much an infinite combination of, uh, of uh, art pieces uh, based on a noise pattern, effectively. I'm not technically adept enough to understand the mechanisms that, that powers uh, the diffusion model, but it effectively takes words as an input and it, it, it spits out a 512 by 512 uh, uh, image as an output based on the words that you use or the prompts. Very, very, very powerful tool, incredibly powerful. Um, and based on the training data set, um, whether that be from Stability or the various different communities that uh, create um, textual inversion or dream booth uh, models, uh, you can get photorealistic anime art style. You can generate an infinite amount of um, uh, options uh, from, uh, from that model. Very, very powerful. Today's, I guess today's topic is not necessarily about Stable Diffusion. Um, but a derivative of stable diffusion it uses the stable diffusion model, but instead of tr training it on just uh, standard images, it this is so crazy to me. It trains it on, uh, I think they're called spectrographs, uh, which are sound. Uh, uh, it's a sound profile, right? It's a visual representative of, of a of a sound profile. So it trains the model on those sounds, so it generates uh, these spectrograms, which can be played back. Um, so it, it effectively generates music, all right? So let's go ahead and uh, take a look. So the website is refusion.com, and we will go through some of the um, examples, all right? So let's start with ancient Chinese hymns. All right, so you can see it generates the, um, the, uh, the spectrograph. <laughs> So that was completely generated, completely uh, randomly generated. So we're going to go ahead and use this new uh, prompt as well. So we'll <laughs> All right, so let's see if we can generate some of our own. So let's say, I'm not sure if it's going to be smart enough to understand that. Let's see if that matches up to what we're thinking. It certainly is rhythmic. All right, let's see if we can do orchestral. Uh, exciting uh, vocal. Let's see what it thinks about that. combine those terms. Right, let's go ahead and start generating those uh, images. Was very impressive. Okay, let's try um, anime music. Um, let's see, we can do much really with uh, K pop, um, piano. Right, let's go ahead and start generating that. Sound profile comes out to what we'd expect for K-pop. 
So that was just a quick, um, a couple of quick uh, prompts, and you can see some of the outputs. Um, so it doesn't do voices right now. I don't think it's quite as um, intelligent enough to replicate human voices with lyrics and make it coherent. Um, and it's, uh, I think the data set might be on the smaller size. But it was able to produce uh, things that sounded like the prompts that we asked it for. So that was, that's, that's just, it's so impressive. So, so impressive. Um, there's a bunch of different applications for this, but it's it could be infinitely generating music um, without human intervention. Um, like a good use case would be maybe in video games um, where uh, you just need some background music, um, or just imagine a fictitious GTA 6 where the, all the radio stations are powered by you know an AI model, a diffusion model. Um, it could be infinite variation, um, so that could ha uh, add to the emergent gameplay kind of. Um, the design philosophy that um, everybody's going for so it's it's incredibly powerful incredibly powerful and um with the right data set um it could be more accurate and produce better quality audio so this is this is just impressive on every single every single level i'm just thoroughly impressed by all these uh recent ai models stable diffusion um you know uh, dolly um chat gpt gpt3 um and there are many other um, models that are out there that are just in the background quietly. So that's one of the reasons I am now officially trying to switch careers into the AI ML field. So I'm, I'm a bit way behind uh, the curve, but um, I, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to work towards that because it's, uh, it's the future of computing. Like, um, I, I don't know how to explain it. It's just super impressive. The computer can do everything. You just need to teach it how to. You just need to teach it how to. So that's uh, that's where I'm heading next. But anyway, that's um, Refusion, a generative uh, spectrogram model, spectrograph model that generates music on the fly. Uh, that's it for me. Until next time. <laughs>